strawberry souffle, the most amazing summertime dessert. Now the secret with the souffle is to use fresh berries. Hot pan. Sugar. Strawberries. As the sugar comes up to the boil, turn the gas down and then let that cook out. Sniff. The jam is nice and rich, but more importantly, you want to put this through a sift to actually get rid of all the seeds. Lick. Chill. Custard. Cream and milk into the pan. Bring that up to the boil. Egg yolks. Sugar. Whisk. Flour. The secret is that it helps to thicken the custard. Really nice smooth texture. The cream and the milk have been boiling. Temper. Just a splash right there. And this prevents it from going lumpy. I'm really excited. Are you getting excited? Whisk that up and then back in to the pan and then cook that out. And as you cook it out, it gets nice and thick. Intense whisk. And that's it. And then into a bowl. Lick. Into the fridge and cool that custard down. Now buttering the ramekins for the souffles. Butter. Upward strokes. This helps the souffle to rise with passion in the oven. Olive oil. Ha, just kidding. Sugar. And then just twist the ramekin. Transition. All right, the jam's cooled down, the custard's cooled down. Mix. Lick. Mix the jam and the custard. Now it's much smoother. Rest. Egg whites. Whisk. Sugar. Egg whites out. Mix. Just incorporate a little bit at first to get it mixed. One nice scoop. Scrape. You want to bang down the ramekin. That gets any air out of the bottom so that it can rise even. And then just run your thumb to help the souffle to rise in the oven. Transition into the oven at 375 degrees. 20 minutes. Powdered sugar. That has to be the perfect way to become a cooking channel for April Fool's Day. April Fool's joke, done.